Crew, can you see us? Are you there? Well then, what's up? What is up? And welcome back. Welcome back. To another edition of, uh, you know, whatever we call this thing. But it's the Good Time Crew and, you know, Justin, Stacey's YouTube, blah, blah, blah. Yes, <laughs> you're the Good Time Crew. Thanks for being here. Yeah, et yeah, cetera, yeah. Et Like, subscribe, etc., etc. Et Don't forget to follow us on Instagram, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. <laughs> uh, let's get into this video. Brian Regan, Foods and Labels. Let's see what the guy's talking about with this one. And afterwards, we got a question. Of course we do, so you better stick around. <laughs> it's like so dorky. He's oh, a great guy. So my doctor, he told me to... Watch what I'm eating. Told me to read food labels. I'm in the store reading a Fig Newton's label. <laughs> I've always liked Fig Newtons. I'm trying to see if it's okay to eat them, and everything looked fine. The fat content, everything. I looked at the serving size. Two cookies. <laughs> Who the hell eats two cookies? That's true. I eat Fig Newtons by the sleeve. <laughs> yeah. You're coming to feed. Two sleeves is a serving size. <laughs> I open them both and eat them like a tree chipper. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. Fig Newton shavings coming off the side. <laughs> then I put a Newton catcher and empty that bag out as a snack. What the hell are they talking about? Two Fig Newtons. <laughs> For the size of a poaching stamp. You want another one? Oh, I don't know. I've already had two whole entire <laughs> Fig Newtons. <laughs> Maybe I could try to muscle one more down, but I don't think I'm gonna. And then we like this I'm big. Stuffed with the rockers. I don't know, those are tiny. They're nuts. We got an ER here. We got a three fig Newton eater. How many did he have? <laughs> <laughs> what is he nuts? <laughs> Doesn't he read? <laughs> Who's coming up with serving sizes? Good question. A serving size of ice cream is a half a cup. What is that? Like, that's so is that small. like a joke some guy put on there? How many scoops hey, is there? come here. Look what I put for the serving size. <laughs> did you see? I just did it as a joke, but they're going out like that. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Just let it go, I guess there's nothing you can do now. You ever know anybody to eat a half a cup of ice cream? Hey, you wanna go grab something to eat? Oh, no. The half a cup of ice cream? half a cup of ice cream. <laughs> the half cup. Yeah, a whole half a cup. I just kept eating and eating and eating. I must have had two spoonfuls. I'm gonna say that's basically all you're gonna get. I think a serving size of ice cream is when you hear the spoon hit the bottom of the container. Right? when you can't do this anymore. <laughs> I even ripped the sock. Well, I like that. Yeah. <laughs> Not sure what they're talking about for that. Half Who a cup measures ice cream. half a cup? <laughs> Man, it's like so small. You know, half a cup is like. I have to lay off dairy, though. That's what my doctor threw in. As I was dairy. leaving his office. Oh, and I'll lay off dairy. I'm like, what the hell? What kind saying. of blanket sweep is that? Mm. And no more happiness. <laughs> Away with you. <laughs> Does he care? I'm trying to lay off dairy. I'm in the supermarket with my little cart and I'm trying to avoid the dairy aisle. I can see they'll have party hats on over there. Look at us. Cheese, milk. <laughs> I'm in the juice aisle, <laughs> slooped over with juice people. <laughs> I learned something in the juice aisle, and that is, I don't know what's going on with cranberries, but they're getting in all the other juices. That's true. That's true. Like cranberry apple. Cranberry. Whoever the salesman is for cranberries does a great job. He's showing up everywhere. Hey, what do you got? Apples? Put some cranberries in them. We'll call it cran apple. Go 50-50. What do you got? Grapes? How about cranberry? What do you got? Mangoes? Cran mango. What do you got? Pork chops? Cran chops. <laughs> Once you backed off, cran man. Why don't you take your sales trophy and have a vacation? 
It's working too hard. It's making the other fruit guys feel bad, you know? Like the banana guy wakes up, man, I ain't into nothing. Yeah. <laughs> Nobody wants bananas. Cram man's all coupled up. You gotta get cracking, banana man. Banana man's lazing off because cranberries are in everything. You know what I think though? I feel like they make those serving sizes mm -hmm. so small because it makes the nutrition facts look better. So if the serving size is half a cup, then the amount of sodium is going to be lower because they're only showing you the sodium serving size for that. Uh, I mean, the sodium count for that serving size. I'm sorry, what did that have to do with cranberries? Oh, I, well, he was talking We're about talking about like, cranberries, good time crew. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. But yeah, you're, you're probably right though because they can say it that it, if it has a smaller serving, then it has less salt in it or less fat in it. Yeah, so if you and just you're like, oh, look at that. There's only 13 grams of sugar per serving size, per teaspoon. Right, but who's, <laughs> when's the last time you scooped some ice cream and put it in a measuring cup? In like cup a little cup. To see if it was half a cup or not. I mean, can you imagine that? You, I mean, think about what you do with ice cream. You're like, you're on a date, like after the date, like, yeah, baby, yeah. <laughs> well, I'm all done. Yeah, here's I my ice cream. I guess I'll take you home. <laughs> or when you do like some people and just eat straight out the tub. Oh, uh, I eat out of the, the glass that Paula gave me. No, you eat out of the tub. No, I she don't. She eats out of the even... tub, and first she leaves it on the counter and lets it melt. Yes, I do. I let it get soft first, but Weirdo. I eat out of the glass that Paula gave me Weird all the people. time. Weird people. He eats out the tub, so you can't measure serving sizes. Anyway, let's talk about what, to, but not the big tub, because I don't get big tubs of ice cream. The tub. My doctor told me to stay away from dairy. The tub. <laughs> all right, so, crew, got a question for you, and imagine that drum roll, because we don't want to mess with the camera. Sorry. Um, my question is, what was the best era in music? The best era by decade. So eighties, nineties, two thousands, two thousand tens. Nobody better say that, because that's definitely not the best era in any genre of music. Yeah, right. Um, but that is tough. I'm gonna say because it's either the it's between the eighties and the nineties. Like the early 90s. I'm going to say the 80s. I think I'm going to go with the 80s. 80s too. 80s. 80s had the best music, the best pop music, the best rock music. The best everything. Everything. Yes. Besides country. Country music has really picked it up in the last couple of years. Yeah, in that's, the last 2000 yeah, that's true. To 2010. But that's true. Every other genre, I think, was really booming in the 80s. So Yeah, that's what everybody looks back to. They're like, oh, remember oh, the 80s? Remember the 80s? We got we yeah, dance and funky and hair. Yeah. And, uh, you know, the rock stars, the pop stars, everybody was on top of the I, world. Yeah, there was like a the new rapper. spring of everything. Everything yeah. was new. You know what I mean? There was always a new version of something. So, yeah. So, Good Time Crew, what's the best era in the music for you? Leave your comments below. Yes, please. Please and thank you. And uh, now that Brian Regan's finished and uh, Justin and Stacy are finished, uh, I guess this video's finished. Hey, look at that. Hey, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. And, uh, you know, come back. Come on, come back. Yes, come back to us, come okay? Back. We want to have you as part of the crew. Come back to the crew. And make sure you're following Justin and Stacy on Instagram. And mm. I'm not talking... I was about to say third person. I'm saying follow us at Justin and Stacy. Fired. I this video's over. She's fired. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. Leave my office here. <laughs>